This afternoon, we're getting a closer look at the moments following a massive explosion that destroyed a home in Ann Arbor. Police there are also giving us an update on what sparked the blast early Monday morning. Our Jordan Burroughs gives us a play by play look at the events. It is dramatic body camera footage Ann Arbor police released it and it gives us a better look at the events of what happened to the homeowner and his house last Monday. It was an early freezing cold Monday morning on South 7th Street in Ann Arbor as several police officers and firefighters rushed to the scene of an explosion. You know who lives here? Turned massive fire. The 76 year old homeowner is doing everything he can to get out of his house safely. It was early Monday morning, the low temperature 12 degrees, community members scrambling, several homes evacuated. Everybody back up! The dramatic body cam video shows a raging fire ravaging the home. The almost 100 year old home gone. The home collapsed within minutes of the explosion. First responders hoping nobody else was inside the house. The source of the explosion. I got one, one occupant. Two 20 pound portable propane tanks used for heating. Nobody else was in the home except for the homeowner, who we learned is named Tom. Firefighters and first responders were on scene within minutes. This is the moment firefighters were able to get Tom away from the fire to get medical attention. Neighbors heard the blast from miles away. A house is destroyed, but a community along with first responders came together to rescue Tom. February 19th, the day of the blast was the coldest day of the month. The low temperature was 12 degrees. Reporting in studio, Jordan Burroughs, CBS News, Detroit.